Okay, I'm just sticking foundation on like. Oh, I look burnt. I just look burnt. How does she do this? I'll turn it down afterwards. Okay, I'm gonna go and. Welcome back to my channel today. I'm very very excited about this video as you can see I have no makeup on I have my hair up in a Low-key greasy ponytail. We're not gonna talk about it and I'm gonna turn myself into Belle Delphine now if you've never heard of Belle Delphine before I don't really know where you've been on the internet. She's absolutely huge and I think at this point I don't know how I describe her as of Christmas Day. She's about to be uh, you know an adult Star. I don't know if I can say the P word and without getting demonetized. So I'm gonna avoid that word at all costs. But you know, she's releasing a little video on Christmas and it's gonna save 2020 apparently. So I'm ready for that. I actually decided to do this because I constantly get called an e girl online. Probably because I have the e girl. Do you know what? She actually has this chair and she has these, which is what inspired me to do this video. This is how I look 24 7 professional e girl and that. So I decided, you know what? I'm gonna get a pink wig. I'm gonna buy one of her outfits, which I'm re I'm replicating this look, by the way. Yeah, I'm gonna turn myself into Belle Delphine as best as I can. So I'm gonna start off by doing my makeup. I've just realized I forgot my primer in the other room. So I'm gonna go and get that now. <laughs> okay, so this is me as Talia Ma. And let's get into turning myself into Belle Delphine. I'm very excited. I actually love Belle Delphine, like I can't lie, I'm a big fan. I know I'm not her target audience, but I don't know, I think she's cool. I love I love it when women just, you know, smash life and that seems to be what she's doing. Okay, I'm just sticking foundation on like I would any day. I feel like it's the makeup's only gonna start to change when I get to the eyes and like the blush area. She wears a lot of like, she wears a typical e-girl blusher look, which I don't really do. I wear a much more like full glam, I guess you'd call it. It's gonna be interesting to see what I look like with this makeup. We look literally nothing alike. Our mouths are completely different shapes. Our noses are kind of not too dissimilar, although I did pay for mine, but you know, foreheads don't matter because I'm gonna be wearing a wig. I also have no idea how good this wig is gonna look. It was like a 30 quid, like 30 pounds. I think I spent it, maybe 40. So it's not gonna be great. I don't know if hers is human hair or not. I think it is. It looks pretty good. I not looking in a mirror. I'm literally doing this on my um camera. Okay, she's got really quite light under eyes. So I'm just gonna go in with my concealer. I'm also gonna FaceTime G and Freya and Simon to get their reactions. If I don't look like Belle Delphine, I'm actually gonna cry. Okay, I'm not gonna cry. I think that's dramatic. Although, you know, today is the day that I have officially realized. Like it's dawned on me. I'm not spending Christmas with my family, so. Uh, <laughs> I could cry at any moment, so you know. <laughs> Let's just powder everywhere. She has a really super matte face. Like, I don't even know if she wears highlight. I think she does, but who doesn't wear highlight? Oh God, I'm nervous about trying to replicate her eyebrows. I think nervous is a slightly exaggerated term for what I'm actually feeling. Nervous is definitely not quite the emotion I'm feeling. I don't know if she contours. I don't think she does. If she does, it's not a lot. Okay, oh, I've left a brush, hang on. Let's do the eyes first, I think, because that's the bit that like, that's really what makes Belle Delphine, Belle Delphine. So let's do the brows. I'm gonna get the brown, because even though I normally dry my eyebrows black because I've got black hair, she has very light pink hair. So she does her brows kind of brown. We're sort of blocking my brows out and redrawing them on, which I'm really not about to do for this. <laughs> I think we're just gonna have to live our life with Tali Ma's regular brows. This brow came out good. Hold on a minute. Maybe this is how I should be doing my brows normally. Maybe I need to retire the pencil. And just use a little tiny brush and some eyeshadow, which is what I'm doing right now. Okay, that will do. That's fine, whatever. She's got much bigger eyes than I do. I've got like tiny eyes. So I'm just gonna have to live my life with the small eyes that I was, I was given, you know, it's fine. It's part of my identity now. This is not how I like to do my makeup. Okay, she, God, her eyes are so big. This is gonna be really hard for me. Do you know what? This is how I used to do my eye makeup back in the day. First starting YouTube, I used to draw my lash line underneath my eye, make my eyes look bigger. Cause I kind of hadn't come to terms with the fact that I had small eyes and I was like, no, I will make them look big. But now I embrace it, you know? It's okay to have little baby eyes. And I kind of need to make my eye look round cause my eyes are quite like almond. Look how gross that looks before you do anything with it. Goodness gracious me. <sighs> I look ridiculous right now. Okay, she does like a big old black bit here. I'm gonna have to stream like this because 
There's not enough time between now and my Among Us lobby at 4 p.m. to not stream. So, to not like change. Wait, was that English? I don't think it was. Her eyes are so much rounder than mine. I know it looks ridiculous right now, but once the lashes are on, I think it will look a bit better. Okay, let's start on the blush. I'll do the eyelashes last. Oh my God, I look burnt. I just look burnt. How does she do this and look cute? Oh, she does do a little bit of eyeshadow. Hang on. Okay, one sec. Let me go get some scissors to cut these lashes as well. It took me like 45 years to try and find... Oh my God, my forehead looks so white with this blush. It took me 45 years to find the um, scissors and I couldn't even find scissors. I found nail clippers, which is what I'm going to use. <laughs> okay, let me do the eyes. You know what? Maybe I'll use these. I've got um, Imogen's Honey, Honey Cosmetics lashes, the Honey Store. And these ones are really big. So I think these ones might work. Like these are chunk hair lashes. Like I said, I've got baby eyes. So this might be the only time I get to use them. Yeah, that works. That's perfect. <gasps> Thank you, Imogen. Legend saving the video. I think if I draw a black line with my eyeliner underneath, it will make that line look a little bit cleaner. Also, I've noticed another thing. Her wig is curly. Mine is straight. I think mine might be heat resistant, so I might be able to curl mine, but I'm a little bit scared about melting it. It's never the vibe, you know? I have little baby lashes and little baby eyes. Okay, this is working. Imogen has saved this video with these lashes. These are perfetto. This is not a good look on me. I'm starting to think maybe Belle Delphine just suits this look and I just do not. It's fine. I can do it. Can I? Okay. So, I think, do I have a white eyeliner? I don't think I do anymore. God, I miss having my old makeup collection. Oh, this is much better now that I've got the light under my eye. It's very anime. My streamer gonna be like, Talia, what the hell have you done with your makeup? Oh, look, guys. You don't understand. It's what Belle Delphine would do. Yeah, from far away. Makes my eyes look much bigger. And then up close, I just look a little bit anime crazy, but it's fine. A little bit of brown above her eye. This is stuff that you definitely just do not care about, but I do. Come on, I'm gonna do it. Okay, so like I said, I'm replicating this photo here. And so I bought her the top, like the bodysuit that she was wearing. And it's basically got the um, diva logo on the front with like the bunny ears and it says game over from Overwatch. I was like, oh my God, that's so cute. I'm actually gonna wear this. It's arrived and it's from a brand called Little For Big. <laughs> so I'm pretty sure it's like um kink clothing for people that like to dress up as children, which kind of makes sense because that kind of is her vibe, but also I'm now concerned. But that's not what I'm going for. But there is a top on the back that says I love daddy and I'm just gonna pretend that that doesn't exist. But yeah, so I'm hoping this is gonna fit. But it's actually, I really like it. Like I wouldn't call this Oh yeah, they sell adult diapers here. Okay, not gonna judge. Everyone has their thing. That is some people's thing. But yeah, this is the... That looks really big. Okay, I'm just gonna move on. And then a standard... I actually already have this skirt, but I use it for Halloween, so I cut it up and it's got fake blood on it. So I just got this from Amazon. It's a standard, like, I guess Japanese school skirt, I think. I don't know. Very cute. I'm gonna put this on. I'm gonna put this on. And then I'm gonna come back and I'm gonna put the wig on. Okay. I'm doing my best to ignore the fact that this was definitely made to have a diaper underneath it. This is actually cute. I would wear this. Like I would definitely wear this. This is me just trying to be friends with Belle Delphine. I think that's what I've come to terms with. Okay, so wig. So I got a lace front, but it's, uh, it is synthetic. So I'm, I've just realized that I'm way too tan to look like Belle Delphine. That's the biggest thing. I might have to try and actually, it's not tan. I'm too orange to be Belle Delphine, but I'm not. I don't have fake tan on. I think it might be my saturation on the camera. I'll turn it down afterwards. Okay, I'm gonna go and find scissors and cut this and I'll be back. But yeah, this is the, wait, hang on. This is the situation as it stands. I mean, it doesn't fit very well, as you can see. And like, this is, this is big on me. But like I said, I think there's like room for a diaper. So not gonna put one of those on, but I'll be back. <laughs> Okay, I need to sort this wig out so bad. Like it is, it is not looking cute. Hers is definitely human hair. Oh damn, she built a boob. Yeah, this, these needs to be like curly. I low key kind of smashed it. Wait, hang on. <gasps> I'm Belle Delphine. Wait, what the frick? Hold on. Why do I kind of love this though? This is wild. Hold on. Wait, let me see if I can take a picture. 
Oh my god, this is jokes. Oh my god, this is so weird. I feel kind of cute though. Now I know where she does it. Hold on, this is this is kind of a look. I think Sam would kill me if I started dressing like this though. Let me see if I can FaceTime. From a place, well, it's, it's a bodysuit. Yeah. It's from a place called Little for Big, and it has space for an adult diaper. <laughs> but it's cute. <laughs> I didn't even know that was a thing. I yeah, like adult babies. So this is from a shop that specialises in like adult babies. How did you find that? Well, I just bought it on Amazon. I did not realise it when it arrived today. I saw the packaging and was like, Little for Big. I was like, what? Yeah. She's got like big eyes, so I was trying to make mine look bigger. Aww, you look really cute. Your makeup actually really suits you. Thanks. It took me a while, like, you, I mean, they'll know. I literally was like smudging. I was like, oh my god, I look, I look I've got panda eyes. I was like, oh god, this is not working. Not okay, I'm gonna go. <laughs> this is getting out of hand. <laughs> Please let me know what Freya's reaction is. Okay, will do. Okay, bye. Right, love, bye. You. love you. Bye. Okay, Freya is the next one. She better. Hi, I'm Belle Delphine. Oh, it's about to Are you trying to be Belle Delphine? Oh my god, you've actually done such a good job. Thanks. I'm literally wearing like one of her outfits. And I've told this to everyone so far, that this bodysuit is from a place called Little for Big. And there is space for an adult diaper. What? I mean, I'm not judging. The wig's cute. Isn't it? So, who says it? You, you, you can't stream like, like this. I think you look great. I look like Belle Delphine. Yeah. <laughs> Although I am low key intrigued to see, G was like, "Please go live like this." I think you should. Why not? I think oh. you are the epitome of an ego. I really am. And just do it. I'm coming yeah, into yeah. my own. Can you imagine? I swear you've got a pink wig. No, it wasn't quite bright. Like the wig I have is like bright pink and quite short. Yeah, it was just a random standard. And then yeah, this. And then oh yeah, the little skirt to go with it. Wait, I don't know. I, actually, I can't show you up my skirt. No, <laughs> Nearly yeah, did. So, yeah. I got really close and was like, oh, hold on a minute. That's like, if I lift this up. In private, T, this is a reaction. <laughs> <laughs> All right, I'll let you go. Thank you. Bye, honey. Bye. I keep cutting people off. Can I not do that? Hello, huh? Hello, I am Belle Delphine. I love it. It looks great. Thanks. Do you want to know something funny? There is space for an adult diaper in it. An adult no, 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 I didn't. They sell adult diapers, and this like bodysuit is made like the bum and like the front has like extra room in it for an adult diaper. Like, this is made to be worn with a diaper. <laughs> I've never heard of that. Oh, okay. You should, after this phone call, Google adult babies and watch the documentary how have you never it's like people pay to like be treat like sleep in cots and wear diapers and like be babies <laughs> oh how have you never heard of this maybe you should turn yourself into belle delphine that's a video i'd want to see oh my god Probably would. <laughs> I've got one more person to FaceTime. Alright. Bye. Bye from Belle Delphine. Bye. 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 Please no. <laughs> Please. Do you no. want to know the worst thing about this? You have to film a podcast. No. No! This bodysuit's from a shop called Little for Big, and there's space for a diaper in it. Is that the one she actually wears? <laughs> yeah. Like on the on the website, they sell like adult diapers. Ew! I know! I'm 
was like, oh my god, wait. And it says like, I love daddy. Not on the on the back of this, but on the back of like the packaging. But yeah, so I am Belle Delphine. So when's your coming out? No. That's what she's done. No, I'm not actually doing that. Although I was like, I'm, I'm now like, I was just impersonating like an internet celebrity. Whereas now I, I am dressed as a star. Yeah, you need to hold a pickle Rick. That's what you need to do. <laughs> I'm hanging up now. <laughs> That's gross, go change. What? I said, you're gross, go change. How dare you, I'm going, bye. Bye. So that is it for me. I hope you enjoyed this video where I turn myself into Belle Delphine. I think I did a pretty good job. Let's have a side by side, hang on. Although she's got like a, um, which photo? She's got a, what's it called? Oh, she's got tights on. Frick, I didn't do that. She's got like a, a octopus. But yeah, that is it for me. I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, I think this is going to go up hopefully before Christmas, but I really, I don't know. So, um, whenever this is live, I hope you have a good Christmas. Or I, I hope you just have a Christmas. At this point, if you are calling it Christmas Day, then you're on to a winner. I don't think anyone's going to have a great Christmas this year, but you know what? It's fine. It's fine. We're just going to vibe. We're going to go with it. But that is it for me. I will see you in my next video, whenever that is. Uh, I'm going to go live now on Twitch. That's it for me. Love you all and goodbye.